Let's get right to it. Right now, there are only two certifications I put in my resume specific to machine learning. They are the Google Certified Machine Learning Engineer and the Google Certified TensorFlow Developer certification. Now, I have no desire to sit around and write TensorFlow code all day. So the only one I'm really interested in is the Machine Learning Engineering Cert. Now, there are other certs I put in my resume that will help for machine learning. Any cloud cert specific to working with real-world data is good. However, for this video, I'm going to focus solely on the Machine Learning Engineering Cert. Now, if you're watching one of my videos for the first time, don't get certification confused with certificate of completion. They're two different animals. I'll put a link below to the video on this topic. Let's cover a few things about the certification. Firstly, I have an exam simulator on LogicBot that's going to help you pass the exam. The next important facet about the exam is the Google Cloud Platform. There are no exams from any of the big three, Google, Microsoft, and Amazon, or any other providers for that matter, that aren't about their products. This exam is no different. The exam name should really be the Google Certified Machine Learning Engineer on Google's Cloud because it isn't a true machine learning certification. Let's take a look at some examples. Now, I'm not going to read the question to you. You can pause the video and read it if you like. What I want to point out is the answer. The answer here is B. If you attempt this exam and don't know BigQuery, you're going to fail it. I've said this a million times before. In the real world, machine learning models are built on top of data. Most of the data is structured data. BigQuery stores structured data. Now, if you don't know BigQuery from machine learning, that's OK. I'll put a link below to a free course I have on this channel to understanding and working with BigQuery. Let's take another look at another example. Again, I'm not going to read the question to you. Let's focus on the answer. The answer reads, use Cloud Data Fusion. Whoa, time out. I've studied a lot of machine learning. I've written books on machine learning. And I've authored an entire platform machine learning. And I don't know what Data Fusion is or what it has to do with machine learning. So what does it have to do with machine learning? Data. It's a data pipeline service on GCP. Don't forget what I preach. Most applied machine learning is data sourcing and data cleansing. And this certification is going to require that you understand the services you need to build real-world models on real-world data. If you're preparing for this certification, do not take this exam without an exam simulator. And do not take it without basic Google Cloud skills. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And have a great day. We'll see you soon.